All right, so if you did what I did, you're pretty stupid like me. Uh, it's time to learn a lesson. I already did this myself, so here's how to deal with it. If you shut the hood and you didn't have the hood cable hooked up, and I accidentally did that, I've reminded myself I don't know how many times, and I still forgot. Maybe you can relate to that right now. I'm going to show you how to get it out, how to get it open. So stay tuned. Let's watch this. First thing, take this thing here out. This stupid corner thing. Take it out. Okay. You reach your hand. Okay. You can see here's the other end of the cable. And if your cable's broken, I'm going to show you where it's at. So you can reach up in here and try and deal with it. If it broke somewhere near the front, you know, somewhere inside the car, it's probably the easiest thing to fix. If it broke past here, you know, you're pretty much screwed. I don't know how to get it open. But uh, more than likely, you can reach it. There's a little ball and socket right here. Okay, and if I reach my hand straight up here, you can't see it. You have to reach up and know what it feels like. I can reach it and get my hand on it straight up here, okay? So you can get access to that other end of that cable straight up here. Let's open the hood. Somehow I gotta get these on there. Needle nose vice grips on the cable so I can pull on it. I can't, I tried it by hand and I can't get it. All right, so after a few tries, I realized I can't get my hand in there with these. So I got a better idea. I took a cutoff wheel and I put a groove in a piece of metal. I'm gonna make a handle, shove this up in there and pull it. I'll probably do it. All right, so this thing worked. I had to open it up just a little bit wider. Well, a little bit wider than the thing. Got the hood open. So that's what you're reaching for. There's like a little shelf right here when you're feeling your hand. And above this little shelf is where this thing is here. And uh, here's where it's supposed to be connected up. It's supposed to be connected like this. I have this little guy in here. There's a little cover on here. So if you if yours is broken, I believe you can actually reach through here and unlatch it um, with a screwdriver as well. So if you took, you're gonna end up breaking this thing trying to get it off. There's clips on here, but you can't really. You have to do them from the inside. And if you're really good, maybe you can put your screwdriver through that little hole right there and push over on the lever but I couldn't even do it right now. I have to shut the hood to do it. So I'll do it real quick. I'm gonna connect this back up real quick and then I'll shut the hood and see if I can open it from here. Just so you know, uh, that way you can do it with either way. Let's take a look. So this is what this looks like with the cover on. It has a little hinge and there's two clips right here. And on the other side, there's a little clip. And then this goes on these little things snap in place inside here we're not gonna bother with that right now I'm gonna go ahead and shut the hood and see if I can do it through the little hole well I unfortunately haven't had any luck I know that's where the latch is let's take a look at it so that if your cable is broken so you can see what you're looking at um, I don't know if it'll help you or not but let's just see all right guys so I went ahead and pulled the grill off just so you can see what's behind here Reaching a screwdriver through here is not going to help you at all. Um, there's no part of the latch. The cable goes, is right behind here. This is, the, I'm touching the cable with my finger. It's about this far up, reach in there. What you possibly could do is reach through the grill, okay, with a hook and try and grab the cable and pull it. But I mean, you're, it's going to take a bit. So if it's broken, it's going to take a bit of, you know, a challenge to get something behind here to grab. I've got the cable right here. That's the hood cable. Okay. And it's on a little hook behind right here. It's, it's, it's like a little U shaped hook. It goes inside of, so to get it out, I have to push it in. Okay. And then around, and that's the hood cable right there. So if, Somehow, if you if your cable was broken, you might be able to reach through here, pull this thing out, and if it was broken, you might be able to just pull it, okay? Like if it's broken in somewhere between here 
and the other part if it's broken between there and the inside of the car uh, probably the easier thing to check first so I would check uh, and see if the cables broken right at the at the uh, pull handle because then you could just grab it with a pair of needle nose and pull it and that would help you out right there but if if it's between here and this little box right here if it's broken between here and there you might be able to you know hook onto it right here and pull it out and then break the casing open and pull it you know I'm just trying to show you where it is okay it goes straight into the side of this thing so it goes straight into the side of it so it doesn't go there's no little nothing, nothing to hook on here there's nothing there I can feel it I'm feeling nothing right here it goes into the side of this little latch and uh, it goes into the side of that latch and it's very integral there's no little things hanging out or something you can grab onto to pull it over that I can feel so the only way is the way that I showed you from underneath okay if it's broken you know if you just unhooked it if you just left it unhooked when you did your service if you did a service uh, service position service uh, mode they call it service position pulled the whole front of the car off and forgot to hook it up like I did um, that's the way to do it right there is reach up from straight up from underneath and use a piece of aluminum or steel cut a groove in it and put that little ball inside the groove and then pull it with your hand and you make yourself a little lever or uh like i said it the cable path goes from here underneath here all the way over behind the headlight and over to that area so you can probably grab use something to get inside here you can't take the grill off because the grill unscrews here and there so you can't do that without breaking the grill um, it's not behind the emblem so you'd have to reach through one of these holes here and try and fish the cable out, which is not going to be easy because it's in a, a it's a U shape behind here. You can imagine. I can't get the camera in there. You can't see it. Yeah, you can't even see it. I'm looking at the camera, and I can't see anything. So it's it's a little shelf behind there that the cable slides into. Uh, sorry about that guys um, the cable slides into that little shelf and then goes along there so the only way is the way that I showed you by reaching up from there or um, like I said you're gonna have to probably end up breaking something to try and get the grill off or breaking get, getting the grill loose I don't see any other way other than that because the cables behind this little case now there's an opening to it right here so it goes into a shelf between this area and over about to right here I can I can just feel the cable the cables are right there okay so if you were to try and reach in to try and grab it reach in the first two inches here and then try and hook right here and try and pull it out you might be able to do it that way I don't know just a couple ideas that might help you hopefully just looking at this will help you kind of figure it out but this thing is very integral. You're not going to get anything inside that. All right. Talk to you guys in the next video. Please like, share, and subscribe. Thanks for watching.